Hi everyone. Nice to see everyone again. Just going to give it a minute just to let people join me. Got my hair tied up today and a bit of lipstick on. Make myself feel a little better. Still suffering from a cold unfortunately and I think it might be getting worse. Um, today I'm going to be uh, something a little bit different. It's not a beauty box. Hi Katie, I can see you. Uh, it's um, a craft box. A monthly subscription craft box. Uh, also mine box. Hi Barbara, I can see you watching. Hi Katie. Yeah, so uh, it came by Royal Mail. It's a first class sign for a parcel. And all I've done is just took the very out of packaging off because I'm useless at stuff like that on camera unfortunately <laughs> um, Hi Nazia, nice to see ya um, I know my friend Barbara will probably love this box because it is a um, it's a monthly sewing kit subscription box uh, it comes in a lovely box like this it won't fit through your door unfortunately it is signed for so it's all printed, it's got little thimbles and buttons, cotton reels and scissors. It just says there, so mine box. So a box within a bag. It is. And uh, so I'm going to dig straight in. Uh, they are celebrating the first birthday, so we've got a fantastic discount for this box as well, guys, later. But I'm going to dig straight in. For this. Oh yeah, Barbara's excited. She is. Uh, right, okay. So on the top, we've just got a little card and nice and neat inside. So the card says, So, bo so Mine Box, September 2018. Welcome to this month's So Mine Box. This month's kit contains the contents, but I'll tell you a bit about those later. And a bonus item to add to your collection, right? So you must be able to build up your sewing kit month by month as well, which is absolutely great as well. I love stuff like this. Hi, Carla. Uh, so we hope you enjoy this month's kit. Keep an eye out on our website for exciting new kits and offers over the next few months. Many ba many thanks to the Sew Mine team. And a big thanks as well to Will uh, for sending me this lovely box. I love doing stuff like this. This is something me and Barbara can do together, I think. She's my best friend and she teaches me uh, all I need to know, basically. She saves me <laughs> from disasters. Pretty crafty. I do like to knit. I do crochet. I do do a bit of embroidery. Barbara's mum taught me how to embroider. Uh, Barbara's mum taught me how to sew. <laughs> so thank you, Barbara's mum. Uh, right, so I'm straight into the box, guys, and I've, I'm just pulling out the first item. So this is uh, the project book for the kits that are inside it. Oh, oh I'm really happy with this. This is so sweet and lovely. I love getting these boxes. I'm just going to open this plastic here. Obviously, I'm going to put full details of everything that, that's in the box uh, in my review. So, yeah, we've got uh, a general instruction book here. So, it's telling me it's a floral rabbit and a hexagonal trinket basket blank basket this month to make. So, I don't know if you can see those beautiful <laughs> pictures there, but that's showing you what this month's box is. And inside, it's... Yeah, it's absolutely step by step, A to Z, all numbered and pictured, so it's super easy. <laughs> Barbara's reminding me that I, uh, I accidentally put a cigarette in my pocket when I was trying to hide it when I was younger. And I burnt a hole in my pocket, and that's why I had to learn to sew before my mum found out. <laughs> that was funny. Thanks for reminding me. Yeah, so, and then it goes on to the instructions for the hexagonal blanket as well. So, and these other bits of paper here, 
is uh, oh wow so it's pat the pattern for the rabbit the cutting pattern so obviously you lay your material onto there and you cut round you make a mark with a piece of chalk or a pencil and then again the pattern for your hexagonal trinket basket this is so cool right so I'm going to show you the items now what you're getting actually inside the box as well as the instructions so we've got first of all this beautiful two pieces of a fabric this is a very delicate beautiful cotton fabric tiny blue flowers and then the coordinating um, blue material that goes with it it's all perfectly measured measured out for you as well so there's no measuring out uh, make mistakes on those so that I'm guessing for the hexagonal basket and this this gorgeous material here it's stunning it's like um almost like a hessian material and it's a beautiful pattern tiny little pink and purple flowers so this is to make the rabbit with and then we get um, a big bag of toy stuffing this is to, obviously to stuff your toy rabbit once you've sewn it all together and pieced it together I'm sorry if it keeps freezing and then the next item out of the box is all your threads and yarns and your sewing needles and everything that you're going to need to pour it together all you basically need to provide for yourself is a pair of scissors and I've got I must have six pairs of scissors in this house and I have got a sewing box with a proper pair of tailoring scissors so like I say I am into me crafting this box is absolutely perfect for me it is this uh, packet here contains all the needles and pins to tack together and to sew together and you could even uh, you don't even have to hand sew these items you could use a machine if you've got a machine I've got a machine uh, I know Barbara's got a machine so we can we could probably get these done pretty quickly but uh, if you wanted to hand sew them, it probably wouldn't take too long. I reckon about an hour each per project if you really sat down and concentrated. And you've got a long stitching needle there. And you've got a spool of white cotton, sewing cotton. You've got two different colours of embroidery cotton for adding eyes and noses on the rabbit and whiskers and things like that and if you've even got a, a pre-spun machine bobbin if you was going to use a machine for the blue for the um, trinket basket matching the blue but you can also use this on a normal sewing needle so there's nothing to stop you using that on a normal machine and uh, also we've got a little bonus item and it says bonus item thimble so a lovely little useful thimble there let's see the good quality ones are quite hard to come by They're quite expensive really for what they are yeah so it's quite a weighty thimble so there's nothing really going to get through that onto your finger if you're a sewer who tends to hurt themselves a fair bit sewing, I don't anymore, but I know some people do. So yeah, I'm really uh, impressed with this box. So uh, tell you the prices and a little bit more information, and then I'll show you the, the items again, because I'm really, uh, I really like this. I'm going to really enjoy doing this this week. I'm going to sit down and actually concentrate on doing these and show you all what I've made in my uh, review hopefully <laughs> so yeah it's uh, £12.95 a month on a monthly rolling contract 
this box. I don't think they have a three, six or 12 month option available at the moment, but I bet that's something that they'll work on in the future. Uh, it can cancel at any time and it, and it does include posting and packing, which is excellent. Um, they do have individual kits that you can buy on the website without having to subscribe. Uh, they're priced between 12 and 20 pounds for the kit. So value for money wise to get two complete kits in one box for 12.95 is i think is absolutely fantastic value when one of, i've seen kits on there for over 20 pounds for larger items and they've got stuff like owls they've got a fairy they've got a gnome they've got teddy bears they've got christmas things they've got a brooch making kit they've got an elf that you can make for elf on the shelf i don't know whether any of you mums do elf on the shelf but it works for me Hi Gillian, nice to see you. I'm going to show you all the items again in a second. So just bear with. Um, you can uh, gift it to somebody, just change the address in the delivery box, I'm assuming. Uh, like I say, it could be a new hobby, it could be an addition to your current hobby of sewing. Uh, it, it's applicable to all skill levels, so I'd probably let Robin have a little try of making something having a little sew as well because she's been learning at the moment too uh, we have got a massive um, discount code uh, available for you guys uh, we've got a four pound off your first box with the code smb4 off though so that's smb the number four o f f all in capital letters but i will pop down that down there at the bottom of the comments for you at the end and obviously if you've got any more questions then feel free to fire away that's absolutely great uh, I'll show you again what we got in the box and then oh, I'm dreading elf on the shelf I always run out of ideas <laughs> I do too I do it every other day it's fine <laughs> Well, there's an idea. You can go and make your own elf on the shelf, that extra little Christmas bit of specialness that you've made it nice. So we had the 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 lovely cards, printed cards, autumn designs as well are coming out, lovely. And then we had the step by step information booklet with pictures to show us basically step by step what to do. So like all skill levels, we had uh, the cutting patterns for the fabric, for firstly the basket and then for the little rabbit which is super sweet. And also if anyone wants any help, if they do subscribe to this box, please inbox me, I'd love to help. It, oh I know, a, a bit fuzzy. Sorry about that, Gillian. But I will be putting full pictures in my review. And then uh, we have a basic stitch sheet as well. Showing all the basic, how to do basic stitches, how to thread a needle. So it is absolutely from, for absolute beginners all the way up to people who can whip up a dress in 10 minutes. So we had the first kit, the hexagonal trinket blanket consisting of the two gorgeous coloured squares of fabric so we can cut those out. And then we have the corresponding colour fabric, uh, colour thread as well to sew it with. Then we had the, the beautiful pink floral fabric, massive piece as well, for the little rabbit to to make with the with the bag of toy thing to stuff him up with and then we obviously we had the corresponding white thread that goes with that the embroidery cotton for making noses and whiskers we had the stitching darning needle I don't even know what the proper name for this one is but I will look it up and we had a little packet of uh, tacking pins and sewing needles inside this little packet, all nice and safe. 
and then we had the little bonus item of the gorgeous little silvery thimble. I love it. Absolutely love this box. I'm super tough with it. Uh, I am going to be making these things this week. I'm challenge myself to actually do that. Um, but if you, there's any more questions or comments, feel free to pop a quick note at the bottom of the link. And I will see you soon, guys. Thank you very much for watching. And I hope you all have a lovely weekend. Bye.